Yeah, morning everyone. So today, I think in the same topic that CTMS. So since we are discussing about the CTMS cloud transport management system, in that we discussed about the scenario number one, means basic configuration, right? So we need more than one sub account, destinations, routes, routes creation, service subscriptions, right? So we discussed all those things here, CTMS, cloud transport management system and also manually moving the data from one sub account to other sub account how to move it so that is also we discussed right so how to move the data from one sub account to other sub account here so that is the manual procedure that is the manual movement manually moving the data one sub account and another account right so apart from that apart from that so we have the so one more way we can also integrate the ctms to the cloud alm ctms we can also integrate to the sap abap environment ctms we can integrate to the so our our cpi transports integration suit integration suit transports here right uh, integration suit transports integration means so whatever like our integration team means it's the very integration suit will be used by the across the every organization normal almost so they will use the integration scenarios they will develop the integration scenarios developments workflows i flows packages everything they will use it to change the so to change their configuration to migrate the po systems to the cpi so they will use this integration suit here then they will do the developments in the development then they want to move to the quality which means so they have to in integrate to the ctms c t m s here so cloud transport integration here right transport the so cloud integration content with tms service so we are doing the manual procedure manually adding the content to the so transport buffer we are importing that is the one approach the second approach is the automatic procedure means automatically directly from the application directly doing from the application means so directly going to the se01 or 09 then creating the tr then releasing so that is the procedure right that is the procedure we want that's not like that directly going to the stms go to the extras adding to the buffer directly go move then moving the transports that is the manual procedure right apart from that directly from the application directly from the application transporting right so in this case we have the one concept is called the so ci or cloud integration or cloud platform integration content so whatever the content we have the tms service right so how to do that one how to perform this configurations here right so to perform this configuration so sap introduced the so sap introduced the cas service cas service they have introduced it here cas means content agent service cas service so they have introduced it here so sir what is there before the cas service after the cas service what has been changed here right so content so before the service before the cache service the only way to transport the integration content so artifacts or application content between the sub accounts is manually export and importing them so this changes with the so this changes has been changed with the introduction of the content agent service right before the service manually export and import service then what has been changed after the service so this cache service is a cloud foundry utility service here this is the it is only available in the cloud foundry utility service and also it's a micro agent it's a micro service it's a micro service it acts as a the agent between it act as a agent between agent it act as a agent so that allows you to 
transport the integration content and it will export automatically to the transport queue then it will add to the buffer then it can directly go to the ctms web screen you can import it means directly you can export from the application basically this cache service is a cloud foundry utility service so this agent this will this act as a like a agent it will allow you to directly export from the application not directly export the directly from the application normally we are doing what we are doing so manually exporting then we are adding to the transport queue right manually you are exporting not directly from the application level you are transporting right so that kind of scenarios will be so done by the this cache service here content agent service here right so here this is the here to achieve this configuration to achieve this configuration here so what we have to do right so this configuration is the very important here so configurations taking the service subscriptions right so why because here so i think three four services we may have to take the subscriptions here right so here what is required here as part of the preparation activities so what is required here here we need so more than more than one sub account that we know why because and also integration content integration content is required in each and each and every sub account each and every sub account the integration content is required right integration content is required in the each and every sub account here integration suite is required here so then along with the the services wise we need the so process like cloud integration so there is a services integration time then the process integration runtime service integration the runtime service subscription is required right subscription is required here this is the very important service so this service is depend on the point number 2 that is called the integration content integration so integration suit integration suit here integration suit is required in the here more than one sub account integration suit is required in the each and every sub account the process integration runtime service is required here right in sub account that is required here right so once done definitely we need the tms service tms service also required that we already done it tms service is required in so any sub account any one sub account you required the tms service here right so once you done it this one then what next tms service so right so then we have to require the cache service here content agent service also required service is required in any sub account any single sub account we required and their landscape one sub account you required the tms service one sub account you required the cash agent service and one sub account is required then the process integration in all the sub accounts you required the integration suit and uh, more than one sub account is required here two or three to perform this configurations right and cash service you required cash also we have just taken then in this case then these are the configuration these are the services you need to take the you need these are the services subscriptions we have to take it out this services subscription we have to take it out here the services subscription we have to take it out so coming to the configurations right configurations so what are the how the configurations or what are the configurations we have to perform so this is very very important why because before we configuring the integration suit transports so first of all we should know what are the services what are the services and subscriptions we have to take it out here we have the all in in one page here right more than one sub account integration suit is required process integration runtime service is required tms service is required cash service is required now we got the clarity what are the services we required here right so then configuration side what configurations we have to perform it here right the coming to the number 
the transport the transport destination for the test node transport destination is required for so quality and the production nodes we required so yesterday we created the transport destinations same as like transport destinations we required right the transport node transport node is for transport is required for so dev quality and and production this node is required here development quality and production is required here then transport route then transport route is for so dev to quality one route and quality to so production one route so this one we have done it right so let me show you here so yesterday we have performed this configuration let me show you so if we go to the development sub account here go to the services and subs, instances and subscription so normal ctms configuration transport nodes routes configurations So we performed actually. So let's see why oh, it's not displaying. It's loading. After retrieving the subscription, Open support ticket. Oh. What happened? Subscriptions. Let me refresh. Yeah. So transport node, transport routes, right? So then, so here the main thing is the the main thing here. So this and all the we know destinations creations, right? nodes creations, root creations, we everybody knows that one. The main thing is here, there are the three destinations we have to create. So destination pointing to cache service. So, so whatever the destination you take in the service, the destination service you have to cache service, you have to create the destinations to the cache service. And also the destination pointing to so ci service so we have to content integration so that integration suit we are taking right so for this one we need to take the so destinations we have to create it here then the sixth the sixth one is required the the destination pointing to pms service these three are the major major very important thing so this is this three will be the very important this three we will perform normally right last three are the very important so this will help to automatically export the data create the transport means transporting everything here right here so these two these three so we have to do it in the wherever you have subscribed the the tms service tms service so in that way, there is TMS service. So where there we have to create the, the destinations. The destinations we can create it here as per your convenience. We can create the destinations here. So these are the configuration entities here. So this is the services we have to take the subscription configurations and so services subscriptions we have to take the so uh, into our account here. So normally. The integration suit is available for our trial accounts, but the process integration runtime and the content agent service is both are not available in the trial accounts here. So why? Because this is the very important service here. So process integration runtime service here. So this is not available for 
our sub accounts file sub accounts only the paid sub account means enterprise account only it is available here so in this case only enterprise account it is available in this case what we can do i can so i can show you in the here right here i can show you so before that let's fix this issue let me open in the incognito mode Oh, the same issue. So there is a global issue, I guess. Let me clean the cookies. Yesterday, which we transported, right? The transport data still here. Let me do the cleanup. The subscriptions. So this type of issues, if we use the sometimes, so this type of issues we may face it. So let me clear the browsing data, not here. Now there is a issue. So is it issue with the my account or is it issue with the under SAP side? Let me see here. 